Hello everybody, this is Andrew Roboto 2021 here and today I'd like to do a commentary slash reaction video on some more Childish Dad videos since I figure why not do them because it's been a while since I last did them just because I just haven't had time to do them, that's why I've been doing them as much so I do apologize but I will get some more out as quick as I can because I know there's still a bunch I haven't react to, ones from a couple months ago including the most recent ones in fact some of the some of the newest videos have gotten released i haven't seen them yet because it's because i've been busy with my schedule obviously and whatnot but yeah anyways um without further ado i will react to the the first video i'm going to re react to which is one of the newest ones in fact it's the newest one that just got released is um boris gives childish data punishment day slash grounded which this is going to be pretty funny You are such a moron, and you make grown adults look like a complete joke with your childish ways. So, today wow. is Punishment Day. No, please. I don't wow. Know punishment. A Punishment Day by Boris. Done anything wrong. Why? Exactly. Shut up. He hasn't done anything you wrong. You are getting a Punishment Day Shut for up. nothing. <laughs> because I am an asshole. All right. Let's begin the Punishment Day. First Punishment. Wow. Punishment. I love how Boris just openly admitted that he's an asshole. <laughs> You in the bathroom with the scabbity toilet. No, please, don't leave me. Oh, the skibbity toilet. toilet. Oh, I know that. I, I, I've, I've care, been seeing, I've been seeing that meme lately. It's pretty funny. Oh no, it's the skibbity toilet. Skibbity toilet. Oh my god. I've been seeing that meme lately. It's pretty funny. <laughs> it's just a head in a toilet. Like it's just funny. Second punishment, making you eat a giant piece of broccoli. No. A, a giant, giant broccoli, piece of broccoli. Wow. Broccoli. You cannot make me eat it. What? How are you supposed to eat that anyways? Shut up. Shut up. Broccoli <laughs> I love when now. Boris says, shut up. <laughs> eat it all up or I will give you a punishment week. What? That was disgusting. Well, guess what? I don't care. Anyway, it is now time for the third punishment. Third punishment. Burning your Homer Simpson plush. No. Please. Not this Homer, Homer Simpson plush. Why would you burn it? You don't want me to do it, you say? Well, too bad. So sad, Dave. Because Why burn a Homer Simpson plushie? Homer Simpson's funny. Don't do it. I'm going to do it, whether you like it or not. Oh god. And there he goes. Oh no. My Lord and Savior is on fire. How can you be so... His Lord and Savior, nice. Water? I hope you get run over by a bus tomorrow, one. <laughs> oh, shut up. Shut but up. anyway, <laughs> it is now time for the fourth punishment. Excuse me, but why have we come to the scary woods? Because this is where the next punishment will take place. Okay, fourth punishment, being chased by Seek from doors. What? Oh, no. What? Not the monster. I played that game. Before it, it was so scary one. Well, I don't care. The monster? Anyway, it is now time for your fourth punishment to begin. Oh, God. Oh, no. Here comes the monster. What a big deal, no it, it definitely looks scary. He looks scary. Especially because he's he has one eye and he's bald. That's pretty scary. It's definitely a demon. Jesus. How does he not get woken up by all this drama? That guy in the backyard. Fifth punishment, kicking you into the sun. No. Kicking you into the sun? Shut up. I am kicking you into the sun whether you like it Jesus. or not. Okay, ready. If somebody were to kick you in the sun and... Drop kick you so hard, you went into the sun, you would get burned alive because the sun is over like 10,000 degrees. Set, go. All right, Dave, prepare yourself because it is now time for the final punishment. Oh, God. Sixth and final punishment. Turning you into a potato with this magic wand. Turning okay. you into Here a potato. Turn this moron into a 
into a big stupid potato. Oh no. A potato? <laughs> oh my god, Dave is a potato. <laughs> yes, you are a potato. And you are going to stay that way until further notice. Oh, poop. Ha, Doris. Ha, How dare you give Dave a punishment, Dave, for no reason? That's it. You are grounded for a month. Well, Dave oh, finally no, gets no, justice. No, no, finally. No, 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 no. Well, Dave finally gets justice, so that's good. At least this video ends on a high note, so that's a good thing. Alright, so next video we got Childish Dad's New Lord and Savior. I wonder who his new Lord and Savior is. Uh, again with the ads. Oh, Homer, my glory is done master. Oh, it's a Homer Simpson plushie. Okay. That's his Lord and Savior, I guess. All right, so Dave apparently has two Lord and Saviors: Barney, Barney the dinosaur, and Homer Simpson. Okay, here's your Gotta love Homer Simpson. Homer's funny. Sacred no bonding now? time. Behold, the almighty Homer Simpson. He guides me through life's trials with his doughy wisdom. Um, okay. You're actually worshipping a plush toy? That's pretty hilarious. That is hilarious, <laughs> Sam. I'd have to agree. <laughs> He's worshipping a plush. Well, that's nice, Dad. We'll leave you now to worship the donut loving Lumax. Don't listen to the more great <laughs> He's he's clearly worshipping a plushie. Oh, <laughs> right. Yes, I agree. Wise words all around one. Yes, I do agree. Why would you worship a plushie? Much better than being a boring old adult. Fun just have no age limit indeed. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, but Catherine, this is not just an ordinary plush toy. This is the high and mighty Homer Simpson. He's clearly oh, worshipping a plushie. Oh, but Catherine, the plush knows all. It sees all. It's like having a Billy Dunn builder. Our bond is a sacred one. It knows all. You wow. You really need to get out more, Dave. Hey. You really do. you disrespect the sacred bond between me and Homer Simpson, I'll let you know that Homer wishes those who anger him to be sacrificed in his honor, and you will be next on the list if you carry this on. I do apologize for my wife's rudeness, my lord. If there's anything I can do to make it up to you, just name it. Oh, of course, whatever you desire, my liege. Simpson, Homer Simpson, he's the greatest guy in history. From nice. The state, <laughs> he's about to hit a chestnut tree. Warrior. Oh, no. I have been struck by lightning. What? Yes, you didn't like my song, did you, my lord? Please. Homer's me. Dave's been struck by song. lightning. I nice. I never make you angry ever again. Warrior. <laughs> Well, I guess Dave oh, oh, oh. Dave clearly got karma coming to him. <laughs> All right, next video. Childish Dad meets a talking tree. Ah, uh, it is such a beautiful day today. I sure do love the sunny weather. Oh, cool. It's a tree. Hey, cool tree. You've got a funny shape. You remind me of a green ice cream cone. I love ice cream. Yum, yum. Oh, great. Another is my aura. My guy. Haven't you ever seen a tree before? Well, of course I've seen a tree before, but I've never met a talking one. A talking well, tree? Well, love you. So what do they call you then? Mr. Sampling Enthusiast. No, you silly tree. My name is Dave. Dave the Explorer at your service. I've climbed up hills, jumped in muddy puddles. Heck, I even climbed a treacherous set of stairs. Oh, wow. Quite a hero, ain't you? So, Dave the Mighty, what brings you here to my domain? Well, Mr. Tree, I heard that you are the wisest tree in this neighborhood and that you know a lot of secrets. Secrets, huh? Well, I don't know where it swirls I that secret stash of acorns. But that's top secret squirrel business, you know? Oh, no way. You've got to tell me. Oh, no, no, no. It's top secret. However, I am willing to make you a deal. A deal? What kind of a deal? A deal? What kind of deal? Well, I'll let you in on a little secret. I like to eat humans. So, if you bring me a human to eat, then I will tell you the top secret squirrel secret. Oh, no. You eat humans. Oh, the tree eats oh, humans. I nice. Won't <laughs> I won't taste very good. 
I didn't say that I was going to eat you, you fool. I want you to bring me a human to eat. Oh, my bad. I thought you wanted to eat me. Well, unless you bring me someone to eat, then I will eat you eat to instead. Now, get going. Okay, Mr. Tree, and I know just the perfect human that you can gobble up. Hey, hey, hey. Ah, excellent. I wonder who okay. the perfect person the tree is going to be to gobble up. I wonder. That's the chicken nuggets in the oven ready to be cooked. Hey, Catherine, can you come outside? I want to show you something cool. Oh, not now, Dave. I'm a little busy at the moment. Oh, please. It's just outside. It won't take long, I promise. Just come and take a look, please. Don't make me throw one of my legendary tantrums. All right, fine. If it will stop you legendary from throwing your legendary tantrums, then I guess I can take a look. Yay. All right. Follow me. So, Dave, what is it that you wanted to show me? It better be worth my time. Oh my god. Oh my it's a tree god. With a face. That is the most creepy thing I've ever seen. It's a tree. I know, right? Isn't it cool? Yummy. A chasey human. Help me. The tree is help eating cats. No. That is what you get, you entitled cat. <laughs> That's what the dead was spoiling my fun. Now, it's time for a bitch. You can't do that. I am your wife. You can't do Why that. Oh, knock, 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 knock. Uh, uh, oh, well. <laughs> now can you tell me where squirrels hide their secret stash? Well, I am willing to tell you. However, if I did tell you, then I'd have to leave you blind in my truck forever so that you won't tell us so. What? But, you said if I brought you a human treat, you would tell me the secret, and I brought you my wife. So, can't you just tell me, please? Oh, hey, you are so gullible. I wasn't intending on telling you. I just wanted someone to bring me a human to gamble on, and I'm still feeling quite hungry. And you look at me. Oh, no. Please don't eat me. I am just a man. I have so much to live for. Why? Oh, God. Hey, get back here so I can eat you. <laughs> Clearly, he was not going to tell him a secret. That's why you should never trust a talking tree. <laughs> okay, next video, Childish Dad gets a Barney error. I am going to play some the crack that finished off the Diamond Castle. That I remember this video, the Barney error. It's it's an error they get on computers and in the Beyond universe. I am going to play some that cracked and finished off the diamond castle that I've been building. It's pretty much a okay. meme. That's what it is. The Barney error is a meme. I cannot wait to get back into my mid cracked world. Okay, now all I have to do is wait for it to load. I think I might add a giant swimming pool to my castle. Oh, we got a problem. Oh my god, are you freaking kidding me? I got the blue screen of death. Is this some kind of joke? I want to play mid cracked for the love of god. I swear, this PC is rubbish. Great. Now what? We interrupt your Windows 10 session to bring you a... What? A... A Barney, Barney error. error. Barney. My lord. Barney was killed by Kalu. Kalu put a bomb in Barney's lair. The bomb will explode very soon. Whatever you do, do not turn off your computer. I repeat, do not turn wow. <laughs> off your computer. Oh, no. I remember this I meme, the Barney the error meme. I remember I this. Thought that was an awesome person. Oh man, I cannot bear to watch Barney die. I'm going to turn off my computer. Yeah, except he said not to. Now I won't have to watch Barney be blown to smithereens. I will leave my PC turned off for a little while and then switch it back on. A few hours later. Yeah, okay. bad idea to turn off your computer hours. during a Let's Barney error. Barney error is gone. I hope he didn't feel any pain when he got blown up by King Lou's bum. Did he? Oh my god! Barney cool. Oh no. Barney's angry. He's still alive, and he's angry. Oh, my lord, I did not mean to anger you. Please, show some mercy. I just didn't want to see you get blown up. You fool! You were told not to turn off your computer! Now you must face the consequences! Oh no. I have angered my lord and savior. Oh, Barney, please, forgive me. I did not mean to anger you. I just didn't want to see you die. As punishment for switching off your PC during a bug error, your PC will now burst into flames. 
Jesus. Oh, I, I remember this, actually. I remember if whoever shuts off a computer during a Barney era, the computer will burst into flames. Wow. Barney has betrayed Dave after all he's done for him. What on earth is going on up here? I thought I heard an explosion. Oh my god. What in the name of the mountains has been going on here? Why is the computer on fire? Barney the dinosaur has betrayed me. I hampered him by mistake and now he blew up the PC. Why? Look Dave, I don't know what you did to make the computer burst into flames, but don't use Barney as an excuse. Now, seeing as you broke the PC... He clearly had a Barney error. Why? But it wasn't my fault. It was Barney. He betrayed me. Why? Damn. I can't believe I am getting blamed for something that wow. Barney did. And I also cannot believe that he would go and betray me like this after I worshipped him like a god. Well, from this day forth, I now despise Barney the dinosaur. He can burn in hell. Ah, it is Dave has now been betrayed by Barney and his new lord and savior is Homer Simpson now. <laughs> Alright, so, next video I'll do. This childish dad wants to go swimming. Dave and kids, I have something to tell you all. Which this will be the last video I react to, and then the others will do for a different video. So yeah. Dave and kids, I have something to tell you all. What is it, Catherine? Well, seeing as it's such a nice day today, I was thinking that we could all go down to the local swimming pool. Oh my god. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. I love swimming. Yes, okay. Settle down, Dave. Now, do you want me to go and get your armbands? No. I am a big muscle man. I do not need them. <laughs> armbands, so nice. I've decided not to wear them today. Well, I guess that makes a change for once. Maybe now we won't be embarrassed by Dad swimming around wearing Barney the dinosaur armbands. Well, that's good, Dave. Okay, yeah, he's I, I know. I can imagine how embarrassing yes. that is. Get me in the swimming pool now. I want to go splishy, splashy, splash, splash. Okay, then. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, guys. Here we are. The local swimming pool. I hope everyone is ready to have some. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. You're kidding me. Another funny line from Catherine. Apparently Catherine's getting, like, new lines that are pretty funny. <laughs> Guys, I've got some bad news, but I'm afraid that we can't go swimming today. What? What do you mean we can't go swimming? We can't go swimming because the pool has been closed for unforeseen circumstances. Oh, no. Well, Emma, I bet you can guess what is going to Well, we next. know what's going to happen yes, next. And I reckon it's going to happen in five, four, four three, two, two, one. One. There we go. <laughs> and so it begins. And so it Legend begins. Like the legendary Johnson, dad tantrum. Stop up <laughs> it can't be helped that the pool is closed. I don't care. I want to go swimming. I don't I care. Go <laughs> because they knew I wanted to go swimming there today. One. Wow. I'm crying out loud, Dave. Stop it. <laughs> they didn't Stop close it, it because they wanted to go swimming. They probably closed it because something happened, maybe. But I was looking it's probably because of renovations and repairs. That's why. Because the most common reason a pool would close would be usual is usually due to like repairs and renovations and whatnot. That's usually the most common reason. I know you were Dave, but it cannot be helped if the pool is closed. Now, why don't you go sit down on the bench over there and calm yourself down? I am so disappointed. I was so excited about going swimming and going down the big water slide and jumping out the diving board and going in the kiddie pool. Why? I know. But I guess we're just going to have to go another day. Now, why don't you calm yourself down and then we'll go for a McDonald's? How does that sound? How disgraceful. A grown man crying over not being able to go swimming. Wow. Excuse me? But what did you just say? Wow. Uh, it's a mean old bitch. Another I mean woman. It's such a ridiculous to see a grown man crying and making <sighs> such a fuss over not being able to go swimming. I've been stood watching it all unfold. So, I wow. decided to come over here to tell you exactly what I think of this behavior, and I find it to be utterly disgraceful and disgusting. 
Yes, all right, Karen. Now you just listen here, you stuck up old prune. Uh, I'll have you know that my Dave was dropped on his head as a baby, which has caused him to have problems. So, that does not excuse his behavior. You should learn to keep him under control, because behavior like that in public should not be tolerated. Good day. Yeah, that's right. Walk away, you rude old battle axe. Yeah, my walk away. God. My rude God! I swear, if the kids weren't here <laughs> right now, I would have de-wrinkled her face. I know my Dave can be childish, but I will not tolerate old Karens speaking so rudely about him. She was old, old Karens. Bitch. And she also smelled like wee wee. Why? That's right, so at the end of the video. Alright, I'll end the video here. Hope you enjoyed these hilarious videos. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>